What's going on y'all? Safety Steve here. Today is finally the day where we are doing a review on the infamous AK-47. Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities I see the world through ice covered in ink and bleach Cross out the ones who heard my cries and watched me weep I love everything Fire spreading all around my room My world's so bright, it's hard to breathe, but that's alright Alright guys, so this is a Zostava. It is a ZPAP M70 AK-47. It's actually made in Serbia and it's sold through Zostava Arms based out of Illinois. So I really like this thing a lot. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's bulletproof. We got all the wooden furniture on it. Um, we're going to be doing a, a lot of upgrades to this gun, but I kind of wanted to do a first impressions beginning review of this. So here we go. All right, as always, guys, this gun is completely empty. Nothing in our magazine. Absolutely nothing in the gun at all, as always, while we do these tabletop reviews. Um, thank you guys very much for watching this. I really, really appreciate it. If you guys could hit that like, subscribe button uh, down below, we would really, really appreciate it. And go ahead and hit up the comment section and let me know what's your favorite, AR or an AK. All right, y'all, so this is a pretty standard AK. Um, it is built like a tank and it is made to work no matter what. Uh, we got our front sight post there. We got a little muzzle device. This is actually 14 by one left hand threads. So pretty uh, nostalgic to Russia. So I really like that a lot. Appreciate that they put that in there. Um, we have our mount over on this side so that we can install a rail if we'd like to. I'm just rocking the iron sights right now. I think I want to get a new dust cover that has a rail on it and we might put an LPVO on it, not too sure quite yet. Um, but your basic standard AK, got your little release latch right there to take your magazines out, stick them in just like so. Um, this thing is not meant to be a piece of art, it is made to work in the mud, in the dirt, in the water. This thing is going to work and cycle and function like it should, shooting that big old 762 by 39 round. So I really like that a lot. Um, we have our standard dust cover here. You can pop off, kind of see the internals there, see how this gun really works and cycles. Um, like I said, it's a tank. It's built to work no matter what. Uh, we're gonna eventually switch out all of this wood furniture for probably more railed MOE kind of plastic stuff. Uh, I kind of want to put a nice folding stock on there. If you guys have any recommendations, please let me know down in the comments. Um, but yeah, just your, your basic AK-47. I will give you guys a really good example of this trigger from the factory. So we have a little bit of creep before it breaks cleanly through. We have a really nice reset. Big tactile, shoves your finger forward, you can really feel it. And then from there, just a little bit of play before it goes right off. 
So it's got a pretty decent trigger. I might switch it out with an ALG trigger. Those are some of the best AK triggers I've ever felt. Um, so we'll probably get an ALG trigger for this later down the line. But if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, please let us know. But I'm ready to load some mags up and go shoot the shit out of this thing. Thank you guys very much for watching. We really appreciate it and hope you guys join us for the rain portion. All right, y'all, we're out at the range. We have our Zastava AK-47. We're at about 50 yards. We're gonna take some shots and just kind of see how, uh, how she runs. Thank you. 